YouTube, my name is Wildboy Fantasy 99. Welcome back to Doki Doki Rigs and Music Readers. Now, I've been recording a fa my finale for Honey Pop 2 pretty much all day. It's like 2 30 in the afternoon. I've been recording that since like 10 30, and I'm nowhere close to that. So, I'm going to take a break from that. As you can see, in that when I post the Honey Pop 2 video, Double Day Fun, the Day Finale, that just I've been failing and failing and failing dates. So I said, I'm going to take a break and just try to do an episode of Doki Doki Rigs and Music Redux, edit it, and upload it the same day as June 6, 2022. Uh, let's jump back into Doki Doki Exit Movies uh, Redux. We're picking up where we left off on the last episode. Last episode, we went for the walk with Siori, had an anxiety attack, met her dad, and all of a sudden we're in Act 3. So, no telling where this is going to go. So, uh, bleary eye, I shift around where I lay trying to bring myself up. As I come to notice that I'm not in my own house. What? I'm looking over, I see Siori fast asleep on the couch opposite for me. Did she spend the night down here? Try to get up and quickly check my way with the door. I need to check on Natsuki. Siori stares how apparently knows me. Hello? Hmm, hi. I, I tried to get to the door, but it was locked, and nobody answered. So I bought you here. I told her la I told her last night I was going out. I told her to lock the door and answer for no one. I had the key here. Digging in my jack pocket, I pulled out the keychain. Oh, sorry. I should have thought too. It's fine. Just, I have to go check on her. Colton, before you go, that wasn't okay. The, whatever that was. If you want, I'll come by after school, check up on you too. I can stop by before Yuri comes over to help me study. Maybe I can, um... Uh, maybe I can bring it with me. That's okay. That'd be nice. Anyway, I really have to. <sighs> yeah, don't let me keep you. Sorry. I usually out the door the entire way. The cold air hits me and they start to sound like I mean to slowly meeting on the street. How long was I asleep? Cold, soggy, muddy ground, dirt, the shoes I have for cross stories right now. I hope hopping over the fancy door, sorry, house, man, I reach the front door. Keys in my hand, I reach my house and hasten and lock it. Andrew and I shut it behind me and rushed up the stairs. Nah, it's okay. The silence is suffocating. I can hear the door knob rattling in my hands. So can die. She right situation. She'll be here. She'd be pissed off or asleep or something. But she'll be here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I open the door. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Oh, thank God. Now she's sitting on the food truck staring aimlessly. Turns to me. Uh-oh. She suddenly springs into me and pulls me into her arms. No words come out of my mouth, but... Oh, no. I gotta save. 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 You're still here. Yeah, I'm still here. Are you going to be going? Are you going to come back? Go back? No. I wait for the riches over me. Whew. Whew. Where were you? That's like you can't know. She can. Why can't she? It's for her own sink, right? I was with Yori. We're talking. I fell asleep on her couch. I heard a knock last night. It scared the hell out of me. So I hid in here. I was worried about you when I was alone. And it takes a deep breath. That was you, not me, Yori. She told me she went over to let you know where I was, but she didn't get an answer. I tried to call you, but the phone was up. She let me crash there. Right. The silence between us defend me. Look, uh, maybe we can talk about this. How about I fix you some breakfast or something? A few minutes, two bowls of syrup and aspirin, and some aspirin later, and that's what he tells you. I was worried about you, you know? Me too. She paused before continuing. I'm gonna sound like a broken record here. You should have stopped and stood up for Siori. I know. But I didn't mean to push you that hard. I just felt like if you if you felt that way with your own best friend, then. But that was really dumb for me to think. I should have trusted you more than that. And I spent all night worrying that I could have driven you for good. So I'm sorry, okay? Don't mention it. I'd rather not think about it. Yeah, I don't blame you. Distracted by my own subconscious, I awkwardly put up my school tie. Hey, there's still there's a silver lining, huh? Well, Siri was a lot less unforgiving, so you should be still should be. In fact, she was the first to defend Monica, so... Huh? Well, I'm glad she's doing better at least, yeah. But it still doesn't make it okay. Nancy Gee peers up to the duty person in the home button and take it on the display. What? We should get ready for school. Oh shit. School. Oh, yeah. A 10 minute walk. Your uniform's clean, right? About 4 or 5 blocks. Clean as a whistle. Countless opportunities for him to show up. Um, actually... Are you sure, sure we should still walk? I'd rather make sure we get there on time. Get a cab or something? That's a pause and later. Um, yeah. That might be good. Couldn't take a while, though. Oh, yeah, maybe. We can take our chances, though, right? I'll pay. Colton, are you alright? Alright enough. Give me the circumstances. Okay. Well, we don't have long. I might as well, I'm, I'll go get my stuff. Already dressed in yesterday's uniform, I not to, to change clothes and just prepare my back for the day. I pulled yesterday's textbooks out, I put today's textbooks in, and catch a dark look in my reflection on the TV. Try not to look again, I sit my bag next to the room. 
Task is already waiting for me by the door. Ready? I suppose. Open it. Open our shoulder days and turn it over here and down the entry. Okay. My ears break up the hands and open the entry is closer. I'll wait in there until I retreat into the house any moment. That's where I'll queue the right now. The page of the taxi runs on the long meter. However, I shake away to the cabin before folding back to the door. Okay. Task is follow the center and pull back down here to the fourth shot. We set off. School we go and now it's over. Roll over. Yep, the bell rings actually sign on my lunch break. I spring out of the chair but stop myself leaning out of the classroom. I can't make myself noticeable. Following the crowd of the maze of hallways, I come to the grinding home. Who's calling me? God damn it. Can't catch a break in these mugs. Uh I was starting to trickle past me. I came closer to display to cut my attention. A soccer trials, blah, blah, blah. Lyman on this place, then the cup of land, picking the bucket for my suspicion. It's a flyer for other clubs. Came through, I noticed the ones like debate club and chess club, soccer club, and hell, even the anime club. Among, and among them, the literature club. After I let letting the literature club screw itself up, maybe I can maybe fix, not fix it. One offer them and I was falling to the left. I dumped my bag, dipping out the door, and led them to the courtyard. It's packed with students talking up the bleat, uh, benches, all except quick to snatch up. I take my bleeding uh, gushing fountain. Planting myself down, I dig through the bag, look for something to eat, and I find that something hasty either if I got the packed lunch. Crap. I can change just bidding my time wandering the halls into the bathroom, but I'm not too team losing my spot there. Hallways, bathroom. Scooch up. Nesky suddenly marks to make me flinch and speak beside me. Hey. Didn't you know you ate out here? Yeah. She pulls the massive tin out of her bag. Dang. Where is your food? I usually make my own, for God. Shame. Don't usually get mine from Karen, but I have money today, y'all. Here's the thing. Mm. Oh, he gave me a shotgun. Oh, where she's never late speech in the pen in her first month for today. It's where to think that they were going straight home. No club, no stupid poems or whatever. Yeah. I mean, that would have been the end of the day situation if we were still back home. Wonder how. Ugh. Shit. This game's too much, man. Eric the Colton, you there in there? Yeah, yeah, sorry. What's up with you? Are you good? Oh, that's on her face. Yeah, it's again, I'm fine. Listen, if you're still mad about yesterday, I get that. But you can't at least tell me. I don't know what, what you're on about, man. I'm fine. If you say so, she gives up returning her sandwich. Noticing that remembers the bag, which I don't think is just. Come on, eat something. Oh, um, thanks. I revealed them in a tea pack open. They're very strong. Not quite for my taste, but I wouldn't complain about free food. I just want to get back to class as much as I want to spend time with her. I know I'm supposed here. I collected the demolished chips. That's a key wipe your mouth and sleeves covered in the tinfoil in the bag. Come on, next class, bell. Finally, I raise up from my seat, ready to go. Only three lessons left in the cab home, but how can I rationalize about there? Two taxi journeys in one day, crap. That's a good pull me, Tracy, kiss, kiss. My vinegar, mm, vinegary. Well, I'll see you later, but well, I'll meet you at the gate, okay? Yeah, see ya. He slings her head and we're taking off. And I want that to be my girlfriend. What's next? Social studies. The fact that I can really keep up with social studies is talent. At this rate, I'm wasting both my time and the teacher's time being here. Eager for the lesson to end, I buy my scribble to mean this garbage to my notebook. Soon enough, the bell rings finally singing at the end of the day. This time, I pull straight out of the classroom. Can not risk seeing her. Half running through the corridor, making my way in front of the entrance and burst through the door. Not only I am one of the first students at Minoski, is nowhere in sight. And I'm early. Waiting for the game, either way, how exposed I am. He could at least spot me a mile away, but he doesn't know me. He drove the past few right without the second thought. So if he sees me with Natsuki, I go off. Eventually students begin trickling out the doorways. How late is how late is everyone else? My friend with my keys in the pocket I have to check on my watch. It's only been two minutes. Felt like an hour. And a sea of people from early face six up. Hey! Hey! Good to go? Mm-hmm. Bit of rush though. Well, what's up? Need an excuse. I think I left the door unlocked. Oh crap. Yeah, let's go. The deal was quick to depart. I reach out to Natsuki and put my hand to her. She takes my hand in hers. Need to get home quickly. It's only ten minutes, I tell myself. It's early afternoon, I tell myself. You should still be at work by now, I tell myself. Calm down. Just get there. A to B. Home safe. Just get there. I pull to the nearby island. She won't think of much for me. I need to act normal. I'm normal. Strike up a conversation. Hey, Natsuki. Hmm? Since the, uh, since the literature club's kind of disbanded. Oh, have you gotten any thought about other clubs? That's one block. Um, no, why? Have you got anything for light? Uh, not really. But I need to pick up a little late morning to go back. I was it was about five PM when I saw her saw her dark right down to the house. It's three o'clock now. Oh god, that's all I know we can be here any second. Sounds good. I don't know, easy just to admit some of the poems. It was a bit cheesy, you know. My eyes started around my school watching every corner pass. Only a couple blocks to go now. I hear in a distant from the engine from two blocks away. I'm sure. But before long in this pages, I don't really focus on Natsuki. 
be normal. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. Something on your mind? How about your dad's gonna fucking kill us? Nah, it just happens sometimes. Finally, home stretch. Still not to not ideally breaking through a run. However, she's caught off guard in nearby falls. Well, hey, careful. Sorry. I make sure Vera isn't dead even. You should complete the box. It does encourage me to throw me along. Just gotta find the damn key. There. Opening it up, I rush to Nessie before sending the door behind me. We're home. We're safe. Nessie does wish to go back on the floor because it's in the kitchen. I grab that TV and switch on to calm myself back when I was in the default movie reruns. Check the window. Nothing. Before I know it, she's back with a glass of water. Drink. Huh? She sighs. I haven't seen you drink anything today. Something's clearly bothering you. If you want to tell me the least you can do is look after yourself. Oh yeah, thanks. I guess I've been really, haven't been really paying attention. Yeah. Now come on. She nudges me. Double check the window. I think it's super by the worries. Good. So, you said something about the Olympic club for gloves? Yeah. Keep checking. I don't know. I guess I thought maybe we could uh, fill the void for that little triple glove. Could be nice. Mm -hmm, I hope so. I begin roughly my score, but I feel a little late. Oh, 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 oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, why is Natsuki staying put, what if it's, hey, oh, oh, hello Natsuki, hey guys, Yuri, oh, of course, I forgot, I should have kept my mind that Yuri was coming around, I should have told Natsuki that they're both here, I approached the door, making sure my friends said no, yelling Yuri, where's Monica, hi, Colton, hi, is the front door wide open like this, do you guys want to come inside, sure, Yuri, are you coming, or, um, okay, I they decide Yuri and Pal. I nearly sent the door, but slow down the last second. Yuri makes a dash straight to the couch, while Yuri sitting the look of the door lately offered a seat. Sure enough, Natsuki's the other one who offered up her spot. Yuri, you can sit down, you know. Oh, thank you. She seats next to Siori. Natsuki holds up the chair and office again, picking me for the over. So, what's the occasion? Colton didn't tell you? My eyes dart over the Natsuki. Regardless, the fill both girls began to start to look. Well... Sorry, takes a deep breath. Yesterday, Yuri offered me to help me out with my studying because, well, I've been pretty distracted since that. I was going to go on to Earth's first, but her parents didn't really like the short notice. So, anyways, I thought, hey, why well, wouldn't you make the proper thing with Colton Natsuki only if you two wanted to, of course. Oh, yeah, obviously. I just thought it might be more fun. And no, we definitely need to catch up. Except Yuri. She keeps on top of her makes a little dizzy. Uh -huh. Oh, Sierra, not that far ahead. I'm just important to prove myself in the future. And the test is on Friday. Yeesh. We got a test. Uh, so, are you guys up for it? I find it hard to imagine that being able to focus on saving. But after my brain's well tried, who knows? It might be taking my mind off the situation for a while. Sure, that's key. It takes for a second. I am okay. I'm in. Can't hear. It's algebra, right? That's right. I should probably go get my textbooks and stuff in. Oh, we've got. Don't worry, you guys can go ahead. I'll be right back. I quickly take my right hand upstairs. In my room, I dig around yesterday's textbooks on the desk. Advanced algebra equations. Fun. I think I know maybe the other half of those words. That's about to let us use the door. Hey, Colm? Yeah? You gonna be okay? I can I can clear them out if... No, it's alright. We probably should study anyway. It's not like we have much of a chance to catch up, especially with the day we missed. Plus, there's a test. I guess so. Come on, we should join then. He nods in the agreement, leaning back downstairs. He the the room, I said the books stored across the floor. Jerry and peer over the muttering back and forth toward each other. Looks like they got a head start on us. Okay, I've got our stuff. Looking back to the window for the last time I measured the sides, I put my eye on it. I'll be okay, I'll be okay, and just steady. Aside from scratching the pencils upon up with the room door, none of us have really chance to study with each other before ancient to speak up, I guess. I slammed my pencil down expiration. It's the sounds that I'm gonna have to break. Because I'm just jumping out of the window. Oh, okay, I got insane. Okay, I'm going insane, but you guys have trouble with the question five too. Suddenly all eyes speak me. Sorry, you're not so excited, laser hand on something. Yuri after a moment nods. This has to be a misprint. It doesn't make any any sense. I'm at loss. Yuri doesn't know? Screw this, I'm googling it. She snatches up my phone off me. Oh shit. Hey, shot it. Yuri stuff as a giggle, but quickly replaces with another round of sounds of waiting for us. I tell him when Yuri speaks up. The Natsuki, I didn't expect to see you here. As living here. Oh yeah. It's a long we're together. It's a thing. He looks up temper for the people shut up to hold the Alright. Oh, congratulations, you two. Yeah, it's exciting. Thanks. Uh, where were we? The answer, yeah. Speaking of, that looks like we're still showing up the solution. Literally, how? Whatever. I don't. Uh, but, how else should you expect us to solve it? I've grown to write this down, the answer is picture. All good to move on? I am. Yes. Now, let's get nods and phones back. I feel back to my text was her with a note taken. Ain't it just shit? And that's that. Several notebook pages months later stretch my arms out. It's about four or less than for that. Try to forget it. Ah, Yori. 
Interrupting my train of thoughts for you, that's how long drained it out, yawn. All this studying was as exciting as you thought it would be, huh? Hey, I am joined, I'm just getting a little worn out. You enjoy math? Yeah, so? Psychopath. He sticks out her tongue and that. I like the feeling of completing a puzzle in my head. Though it's getting a really thing. In which case, I might as well take a short break. Yeah, I guess to see what any snacks around. Oh, yes, please. I've got some coffee, some hot chocolate, a pack of two green teas later. Where's the soda? Any of you want some? Mm, can I get some hot chocolate, please? The tea for me, it does not bother. Not at all, that's a key. Oh, huh? Hot chocolate. Yeah, yeah, sure. All right. Okay, we are back. Can continue. I don't know. My parents just got home, so then the kitchen's a great job. Looking. I pick up the approximate from the by the way. Do you mean enough? I sit back down and flick the switch. The kettle comes to life. They built the ground on the plate. Reach into the cupboard. I grab the generic mugs and pop I sit here. I instantly got the coffee again. Fresh from my own drink. I begin to stretch out the tea pocket. The dealer shows up. Hey, you need any help with the drink? Oh, sure. So that it, uh, I, so I did say I check up on you. How are you feeling? Do you really want to know? Do not. Well, the good news is the main to clear everything up and not to you. Hey, that's something. The bad news is I'm, well, I'm terrified. I'm sure you figured that out already, but I'm sorry. Not your fault. It's just this morning I got a taxi before the walk to school, and on the way back, God, I felt like my heart was going to slow. I even went to school because... Because I didn't want to tell her. Without a proper response, sir, it's best name, but we'll manage. Hey, that's a that, that, that steady thing's keeping me up in my office, so thanks. Colton, you can't hide from, the, from this from her forever, you know. It'll be tough conversation, but she has to know. It's really not something to feel important for her. I get the concern, but we talk about this another time. Yeah, I guess. Sorry, sir. It's just, no, I understand. Don't worry about it, okay? Okay, my dear, it just... Yeah, uh, get only has to take the drinks off. Sorry, could you grab the two and one for a little hot chocolate two cup for sure thing? He digs around one of the upper cup for grabbing the pack of the hot chocolate for us me. Thanks. Tearing each sachet open with the teeth, but dump them up. Taking the kettle, I slowly pull the boiling water into the mugs so I with the spoon. Story grabs the two mugs while taking the other two and together bring them in the living room. Thank you, Colton. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Whatever we all drink and see. He appears around the living room taking whatever to join your drink. Soon after she sticks up. I like your house. The decor is very you. <laughs> Thanks. I wish I was the one with great taste, but I was all my parents doing. Well, apart from the mess, that's all him. Thanks. Anytime. It's simply nobody wants to talk about the elephants in the room. They would have to happen eventually. It'd be better to better than rip off me now. So, uh, earlier now, again, I was in the options for other clubs. Sorry, and I both turned him away. All eyes on me. And I figured maybe you guys want to take part in that. Oh, I don't know. I don't really know if I fit in anywhere else where. Well, there's a lot to offer. I got to leave a bag board over there. Now he snatches out of my hand and the game to over. Before handing it over to see yours, James the Eerie, and before Law makes his way back to me. You don't see anything you like? Not really. It's just not the same. Really. I mean, that's the so There's the bacon club, the jazz club, and the bait club. I could never. You're in the way from which living in the bed. The bacon club seems a little intense to me. I can probably put together a solid agreement. But I actually did nothing clear to conscious way. Yeah. Okay, maybe that's a closer turn to a good idea. I don't like keeping myself away from the large club, but I like to know if there's some well, where there's some less Monica. Turns out they probably treat someone with a mental illness, no offense. Despite the bluntness of her statement, sure seems unfazed. I guess. Perhaps in due time Monica may come to her senses on her own. I doubt it I've doubted she seems to act during the party. That kind of attitude seems green. She's gonna need a real talking to. Just don't know when I lose I don't wanna lose my temper again. She shoots me a guilty look. I know. I just want her to get it. Well we have we have to talk have you talked to her since? It's probably just to keep your words how you feel. I should probably step out of the plate. The least I can do is replace you, and I don't think Natsuki would forgive me if I didn't. Maybe I could talk to her for you. Well, that's really nice of you, but I feel like anyone in my could it could be me. Alright. I really do appreciate the gesture, though. I nod. It's just a bit touchy right now. I will do it soon. Pinky promise. I don't want to leave. I want to stay out of the. I don't want the club to stay out of action. None of us do. Natsuki and you are both not in agreement. So. Before I can have really the subject in your piece of chicken from. Ooh, she cleans it with good expression. Oh, goodness. I haven't realized the time. She begins to organize some sleep in the public floor. Colt, Natsuki, Siori. This was nice, but I really must be going now. All right. Your mom wants you to be home? Yes. I forgot we're having a family over for dinner tonight. Sipping the bag, she rushes over to the front door. Want me to walk you out there? Oh, thank you. Siori slips on the shoes, catching the ears, or been halfway through. Uh, I guess I'll talk to you two later. Yeah, see you guys later. Oh, Colt, thank you again for having us all over. Happy to accommodate. I splash a smile their way. To take the time to leave my voice fading and disappear down the street, slow the creek shut. I click reach over to fold the phone the rest of the way out. Well, that was nice. The mask slipped, but it was nice seeing him have fun. Eh, yeah. 
What about you? You know what I'm like with anything at Kennedy. But yeah, no, I had fun. I think we both needed the company. Yeah, maybe I'm worrying it too much, but it seems a little off. No offense, but you seem a little weird all through today. Well, you know what this morning was like. I guess that's still catching up to me. Yeah, yeah, I suppose. Well, either way, I trust you. And I'll call the science. I'm gonna get changed, okay? Yeah, okay. Now as you depart, the stair cleaves I'll the stairs. My mind's full of the tip of the process they advance. But even as my head's about to explode, I can't help but the literature club through everything. Things are just in so well yesterday. It's hard to think about yesterday with the last club being possibly ever. It feels almost surreal. Given nobody wants to turn the club, seems like Natsuki and I are on our own. No support groups, no safe haven, no police, just me, her, she already next door. It's us against the world and the psycho Oh, when a psychopath may be hunting us down. I rather to peer out the window. Nothing suspicious. Clear enough to see I grab the leash of trauma. However, I hesitate to watch. I grab my bed and huff it next to the geometry expert and the shimmer. The reason. Oh, it's a poem. I haven't been reason to appear too much. Before. I had food, water, and able to just room pitch black. I walk something later. Didn't have to alert at this time. But at first, I resisted the thought why did I waste time. I finally pulled the door open without a sound. I'm flooded by burning lights outside. The door opens and went to the room and listened. The door had closed. When it gets done, I can sleep the whole time. Well, with the Nancy, it's pretty bad. And long, went long way too. But they're only taking mine off. Him. Now, he makes me wait. Make it dance slow to long span. Hey, would you look at this? Hmm. I found my poem. The one I wrote for the club on Friday. Oh, yeah, I remember. Well, we never did get to read each other's poems like we planned. Now, Tsuki Legion's looking for her own back. You sure you want to? Hey, I can't hurt too much. Even if it's just a constructive criticism, she shrugs. Sure. Are you both standing for me and us because we're in the list? You gonna get over then? Oh, yeah. I hand my poem over to her. In return, she twisted her poem in my hand. A dollhouse. I remember my toys when I was small, like kitty kid, a horse to play. That's really weird. When they love us, but had the last six miles for anyone else to live with. That's a key. You charged me out of Raspberry Four Boots delivery. That was really. Sorry, just a sec. Now I give her time to finish reading my poem. I watched her read Natsuki's eyes to the page. I hope she likes it. I can barely contain my own thoughts of hers. As a smile lowers, you face your voice, share a look. Wow. Very disturbing to jinx you, both Jack Levay. Somehow, you prefer scrolling or socking me in the arm. A few anxious seconds pass for both trying to figure out. Natsuki wins. I really like that. And caught by surprise. Wasn't a bit too much? Eh, since when there was a problem. I mean, it was a blonde head, bud. I didn't think it mattered. Huh? I just thought, why would you and Yuri have conflict styles? Colton, I was talking about being needlessly worried. I don't have a problem with someone being long and let's stick down for six and Lewis. I just think, I don't know, the story you called for. I suppose I should. Maybe it wasn't the big problem after all. And speaking of the whole story, with that warning, she lays the shimmer down on the garbage table before coming to hug. Big thing, I'll literally jump back Lulu. She lowers her voice and whispers, You're so sweet, Colton. And man, you're gonna have to show this to the club. That really means a lot. So thanks. I'm happy with you, so it's no problem. Unless you're gonna respond, I grin back. Now we're the beginning with the dollhouse. I run the words here carefully. I hope this isn't too sensitive. Were you really gonna show so dollhouse to the club? That's a key box for my more entry. I wasn't. It was very much a it was for your eyes only. I thought the same seems very planted. Yeah, I planned it. I could never get something I always I could have the knowledge. Maybe it's just always because I know what they mean. Well I'm sorry, Colton, I just knew, but I never risk it. You know, I wrote something a little more than just did for the club. Well, I'm allowed to see it. You know, it's been constructed criticism and stuff. I just scratched the back of her neck awkwardly. I uh, ripped it up at Monica's face. Did you really have the hammer to point to her heart? Knowing where it leads, I was second guess bringing up. In fact, maybe it's all way better. Don't go there. Yeah, thanks. We take a second look at each other back and forth. That's a good lunch. plane to kiss on my cheek before turning the TV on the remote. Well, I'm beat. The man probably did a number on me. I'm gonna find it something nice and super to watch. Get the light, would you? Sure. Resident in my favorite make boys, which I'll leave an elimination of the TV. Take less back on the sofa, and that's a key follows. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Save. The path and dozen different programs. There's never anything good on it there. She chuckles. Eh, I guess not. Maybe we could watch a movie. I've got a few. Who I think you might like, you know? That's not a bad idea. Get settled then. Here, help me pick one out. I opened my streaming app and went to the few movies. I even dared to scooch up close. Aww. The film was really funny, but this one has a master quality. The lead guy was trying to go with the chest. Me. Second. Yeah, just so you know, I messed up. I missed maybe the first 20 minutes, 20 30 minutes because someone's got to make dinner. Oh, did you need some help or? No, dumbass. You stayed put while I do all the hard work. Oh, thanks. And without another word, as he disappears in the kitchen, I leave we head over to the window to ask for one last thing. No thing. For some kind of piece to shut the curtains. I yawn and I agree to fit the plan. Jump the cribs to kind of held back in the place. I feel my eyes getting heavy been the on the couch. I'm sure it's gone past the place to really take him out of me. At this point, I deserve a break. Hey, do noodles sound good? It doesn't look like we have much of anything else. Colton? Oh, no dinner. Well, no dinner. Shit.
Guess we'll be hungry. I'm gonna continue for a second. Why not? Oh man, I'm scared. Maybe not a good idea. Wait, don't leave. Colton, if I stay, I will become as dangerous as I am. Do you know what the... What do you do if you find you with me? I have a pretty good idea. Just hear me out, okay? I need to think logically about this. I... Fine. So, say you leave. Where do you go? Much as I hate to say, there's no one else in there. There's my mom's family, but... Too far away. Yeah. There are only two... Other two solutions. Either you stay up here for a month, or we go to the police. Is that her eyes wide? No, absolutely not. Hey, you're the one preaching me about how dangerous this man is. How about we go straight to the people to each other lock these come back up like it? Said the million times I'll say it again. They will not do a damn thing. I will get dragged through the system and trauma all of that all over again. For nothing. They can't just do that. They didn't play by the rules and when I was ten, so why should I expect them now? Listen, I'm sorry what happened before, but if this or you find this right, I just don't get it. We don't need to get it. You just need to listen for me for once. I understand for you, I really do. This means spending your life in danger. I'm scared that you might not get the help we need because I'm afraid of consequence actions. I already told you why I'm doing It's not good enough not to be. Oh, fuck you, Cole. Mm -hmm. We can call the police. You may as well walk me straight back home. It's a death sentence. Alright, fine. Let's assume no times. What now? She thinks so for a moment. Ooh, just give me enough time to pack. Maybe I can do get to my mom's family. How are you planning to do that? Are they like on the other side of the country? I don't know. God, she shakes her head making the ideas. I don't know. Listen, do you want something to eat? Take a few minutes to try to calm down. Do I want to? You want to let Sure. It's better than going around in circles like this. I'm not entering the kitchen. Cereal again. Two bowls, quarter jug. Breakfast comes to go without a word. I think we're bowl is stacking up the wash. Not to get us the same thing in the back of the living room. I follow taking a seat next to her. I'm then go for the break. But I'm still have something to confess. Cole, can I be honest with you, Natsuki? Oh, now you're being honest? Okay, I'm sorry, shoot. Everything seemed so clear at first. I thought I had everything under control, but now it's like I can't go a second without mentioning how everything will go. And now I dread you doing time. Hey, wait. Look, I know we two trails off. And cost. The whole thing might be a mess, but it's our mess. If anything, we're dragging into this, so don't try to put the blame on yourself. Just don't keep stuff like that for me again. Of course. So 
really transparent from here on out, right? And it goes both ways because we're gonna because we're gonna get nowhere if we keep adding stuff to each other, especially stuff like this. Yeah, that's gonna get from most things. I'll rest her head on my shoulder. I gently stroke the hair and cool it there. We stay like this for a solid five seconds. Come from the clutch. That's the size. What do, what do we do, Cole? Well, you already know our options. Either we wait for you until you turn 18, you train your best to drive 400 miles, get your miles finally so outside. Yeah. You want me to be honest? I'm being honest. But no matter what, I'm with you. Really? Really. Besides, we only got 32 days to go. So we just have to keep our heads up until the November. Then there'll be no tears across the city back there before. Okay, that sounds like a plan. I'm sure it was given, but it means no school. Oh, yeah. We just have to try to keep it up with our work. We're going to have to take a hit no matter what, but it might help. Of course. And hey, we might be able to make something fun. I think fun to curve the subject, but yeah, I like that. Besides, I love you, Colton, and I love you too. I'm sorry for not telling you. Well, it's not out there. As long as you reach the road, hold on, Colton. You try to get some sleep like an actual sleep. You look pretty desperate for it. You sure? I can hold down the fort here, though. So, can I borrow your phone? Why? I'm gonna talk to Ciori. Tell her we won't be going to school for the for the first of my teacher. Oh sure. I hid my phone to mobile. Uh, there's a charger down there in the back of the TV somewhere. It's a relief that finally got off my chest, but I tried to push it to horror buff off of my mind. For now, I need to sleep. What now? Oh, no. Oh, not another bad dream. Shit. Oh, man. Yori, Natsuki, is this a dream? What is going on, man? I rub my back to the center of the TV. It's not really all that loud, but enough to stir. Hmm, hi. Hey, what's the time? About half past four. Great. Sorry I slept so long. You needed it. What were you watching? Don't know, really. Just channel surfing. How you feeling? I leaned up making the space for her to catch. Mm, still a little tired. You want some coffee? Oh, I'm sure. You having one too? Nah, I'll stick to hot chocolate. If that's alright. Don't know how much we got left, but let's go for it. Now he wanders off to the kitchen. The hot chocolate actually brings me to the relationship short. Groceries. While he's still out there for no break, and that's me. When I'm gonna stay, I don't wanna take any risks. I really hope it doesn't come down for me asking sorry. I don't wanna put her on that. No, there's no really all the choice. And now to keep returns to sit my mind on something else. What I miss? Not much. Sorry he came over and dropped off some homework for us. Right. We have to go. What have we got? Uh, I've got some history to catch up. We've also got some math worksheets. Uh, all of a sudden, I'm enthusiastic, but they didn't keep me up with school. But it's important, so at least you kind of prepare for math, right? I guess so. Still, it's just to. Uh, it was hard enough to get the numbers. It was a blurred for we did subject up before job. Okay, I can't promise to be much, but do you have a history stuff? Are you just looking for a reason to boy the math? No. Okay, yeah. But I will actually try. Is there a chance to pick it up? Okay, that sounds good. Better than doing literally nothing at all. Oh, I was just saying in silence. Yeah. So what do you have in history? Zero's the subject of one pages. Or er, look at this first chapter assignment. The speed of processing the revolution. Ah. She begins to be on searching her arms above her head. Hey, come on and tell of a lot more interesting than math. I'll follow a lot more that air would be running through my head all day. That's not setting the bar very high. More interesting than half the stuff I learned. Go period, really? Anything to keep my mind occupied. Sure, I mean everything we have in mind today thinks you finished. Cars, TVs, phones, and some of the first. Oh, very funny. Geez, you sound like my history math teacher. That guy never fails to put me to sleep. At least I'm a little more enthusiastic about it. I swear most of our teachers seem like they're on pile after them. They have to talk about some crap a bunch of insane children for years on it. Of course they do now. I mean, they get paid to do it, and even that's not that they pretend they care. Oh, the yes. anyway, the assessment, sorry. It's the usual working up three moment of evidence. You got a title for it? Yep, right here. Or we can still have the impact of the end of the life, right? But hey, it looks like the election will come in handy for this. Not much of a state best now. I'll be bored out of mind the entire time, but I think I can handle it. Alright, then, why else are we getting I never thought I would come to war. I'd be preparing to move on to the rest of really for me. But the fact we did get the least, into the least early evening is a broken wonder. I stand up and reach my hands out of the ceiling. Well, that wasn't too bad, was it? You're the one to talk. I had to do all the work where I listened to you droning. It sounds like you need to take a break, too. But we're almost done. Compared to the SA Mac worship, did nothing. I crashed back into the couch and over the man table. Come on, five minutes. All right, fine, five minutes. Can we at least sit back up and I see you do it, huh? But we can't waste time with stuff like this. I mean, we have every, we have all the... We're just the math sheet now. Not even closed. The history and math shows us all before pick up for us. Now, apparently it was just, just a real pain for her to get what she could. She doesn't know what your schedule all that well. I'm only ever mentioning history and passing, so I gave her my schedule earlier. She should be getting everything for them, but you have to give yours, hers to someone. Oh, I can text her right now. 
my gosh, she, my gosh, she's really gonna run up away for us. Yeah, it's really kind of her. And we talked. She paused for a second. Sorry to get a little grim here, but she's really worried about you. And after what she told you about Monday, what happened this morning, I am too. I'm not the only one you should be worried about, Natsuki. I'm doing well, well enough. Now I'm more worried than for you, than, and for more worried for you and her. It's kind of funny, isn't it? It's like we're in a triangle. I'm not sure I'd call it funny. Well, you know, I'm like where I'm getting at. It's strange. Yeah, it's strange. But listen, we talked about it. We talked to Shiara about it. I think maybe I should have a big talk. Yeah, let's call it for tomorrow. She nods. Sounds good. Now, math. Oh, uh, really? Well, that's not like we can come back to a little later, I suppose. Thank you. You're a prison, you know that? Well, you, you love me anyway, don't you? Mwah. You can, you can return. Check back later, I might say yes. Gee, thanks. For the addition to prevent the dumbness from the jam service, and then we'll probably reach reality show. Perfect garbage, well, not sleep, that's a relation. As you're gonna browse away from once you purchase a feed on the coffee table, it's probably bad merch or something like that, I don't care. We both just need to unwind. We sit together, change the range of this piece, and long way before to start shows off. And good night. Thursday. Now we're ending the video. We're ending the video. Thursday, October 5th. Hello. What the fuck was that? Well, we'll find out next video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you rate it with a thumbs up, comment, subscribe. Be sure to check out my social medias down below. As always, thank you guys a lot for watching. As always, I will see you all in a future video. Take it easy.